Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna talk about my nursing essentials. And so these are things that I always keep in my little fanny pack just because honestly, I don't know what I would do without these things in my pocket. I am so excited to share it to you guys. So let's get right into it. This is my nursing pouch. It's a fanny pack. It's actually from Lululemon. It is the black one. This comes in a bunch of colors and I'm going to link it down below for you guys. I really like this because it does have an adjustable strap so you can adjust this to whatever your waist length is and it's just really handy it's not super heavy you don't keep up a lot of stuff in here but i really like it because it's compact it looks cute and it kind of goes with all my scrubs so it's just really easy to use and has multiple pockets so i'm gonna show it to you guys right now so the way it clips on is just like this and then you just clip it on like that super easy super functional um you can rock it it looks cute and you just grab whatever you need whenever you need it the first pocket is this major pocket over here so um i keep like the big stuff in here and then on the side on the inside there is a, another pocket so you can open it over here and i like to keep my pens and stuff in here so when I open it up, I kind of have my major stuff in here. Okay, it's not that organized, if I'm being completely honest with you, because I did use this quite recently. Um, but I, as you guys can see, there are two mesh pockets on the two sides and then one kind of big area as well. So what I like to do is dump all my crap in here. Because I'm an OB nurse, you're gonna see a couple things that you may not see on your unit in my bag. But I think the number one thing that I always carry with me is gauze. I have so many two by two um, pieces of gauze. It's ridiculous because I am always looking for this. If I have to take an IV out, if I notice a baby's foot is bleeding, if I need to wipe something, like it's just really handy to have two by twos with you. I like to keep that in the mesh pockets. Um, of the bag. In the middle of the bag, I have a couple different writing utensils. So the first thing I have actually is a uh, Expo dry erase marker. The reason I have this is because we have whiteboards in all of our patients' rooms that we like to write our name on so that the patient will remember your name and any other important stuff. So their goals or um, certain timings that I have to do stuff so that they're aware. So a lot of times I'm like, make sure you feed the baby at this time and so I write it down on the whiteboard so that they're aware another thing that they like to write down is if the baby is peeing or pooing we can keep track of the number of wet diapers just stuff like that a marker comes in very handy so that's one thing I like to keep the next thing I like to keep is my two Muji go-to writing utensils so this one is a pen and it has multiple colors on it which is perfect for report sheets so it has black red pink orange blue uh two shades of blue actually which is awesome so obviously i'm using the black uh pen the most it's just great because if you need to uh color code your tasks for the day it just makes the job so much easier and i know tons of nurses have multicolored pens but again my favorite is the one from muji so the next thing I have is my highlighter. I again love the Muji highlighters because they come with two ends and they have this little glass thing through it which is awesome as you guys can see. Um, so you can see exactly what you're highlighting and it does have two ends to it so you also have the fine tip which I use actually for circling things and stuff like that. So awesome highlighter. I also tend to keep my watch in my bag just because a lot of the time with COVID happening, you're constantly having to clean your watch, it gets dirty. So I actually just keep it in my fanny pack and grab it when I need to. And I also have a pair of scissors. There has been so many times where I've needed scissors, so I actually just keep one in my bag at all times when I need to cut something. Um, it's just really handy. What else are a pair of scissors for? 
I also have this really cute hand sanitizer from Bath and Body Works. Um, of course, there's sanitizer all over the hospital, but sometimes they're empty. So um, this one's called Island Margarita, which is awesome. I love Bath and Body Works hand sanitizers. So I always have that with me as well. Looking at these two pockets on the side, um, these are more for uh, blood work because we do a lot of babies blood work and there's a lot of times where I am needing something for the blood work and I don't want to run all the way back to the nursing station or to the uh, storage room to grab the supplies. So I just have some with me. So that includes band-aids. So I have a few band-aids that I keep with me. Sometimes one is not enough or I'm missing one. So these always come in handy. So I keep that. And I also, of course, have alcohol swabs because you just always need them for like IVs or to clean, cleanse the site, something like that. Again, mostly for blood work. And then I also have two little baby um, lancets, which again, I use for um, poking the baby when I need to do blood work. So when we're testing for jaundice or glucose. Again, another thing for blood work is this little micro container. So this is a little vial. Again, we use this for blood work for babies. So I just have that again in case. And I do have that outside pocket where I tend to keep extra pens and of course a hair tie because I always am losing my hair ties and you just need hair ties all the time at work. So I have that here as well. That's pretty much it, you guys. Um, that is my little nursing fanny pack. Again, I really recommend having that because we just never have enough pockets in our scrubs and sometimes it's just nice to have that freedom. So I really recommend this. Again, I'm gonna link it down below and the items as well um, that you can buy if you're interested. I love this thing. It's again so easy to use and it makes my job so much easier. So I love it. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any other video recommendations or any questions, make sure you comment it down below. Thanks so much for watching. Take care. Bye.